Cheeky Richos Fettuccine Carbonara from scratch. Hi and welcome to Cheeky Richos homemade from scratch Fettuccine Carbonara. We've made the pasta sheets ourselves, we've made the mascarpone cheese ourselves, we've even grown the parsley ourselves. The ingredients are in the recipe box below and scrolling as I speak. So let's get started. Rapidly boiling water, we are going to add our fettuccine strips that I've actually purposely cut into wide pieces because that's the way we like them. And we're going to cook them until they're al dente. Now to our pan on a medium heat, we are going to add some olive oil and our ham or bacon strips. Get them moving with a good sprinkle of our pepper. Bit here, so it's in with our coffee sliced onion now. And we want some crunch in this onion, so don't cook it right now. Okay, now it's in with our thin pouring cream, a pinch of salt, and some of our mascarpone cream. So as much as you need. Make a nice rich sauce. Okay, after six minutes our pasta is cooked, it's just draining now. We're just going to turn our pan down to the gentlest of simmers. Give our two eggs a bit of a whisk, don't get too serious here either. And now it's just in with our pasta. our eggs over the top. And turn it off. In with our very coarsely chopped parsley. Big pieces of parsley, that's the way we like it. And there you go. That is going to be delightful. A bit more parsley, I'll have it all. Just softly cooked eggs, al dente pasta, crisp onion and salty bacon. Yum -o. I hope you enjoyed this little cooking demonstration of Cheeky Richo's Fettuccine Carbonara. If you'd like to see more interesting recipes and ideas just check out our Cheeky Richo channel and don't forget to please subscribe and do come back and visit us again soon. We have so much more to show you and we are uploading lots of videos every week. And thank you very much for watching. I just serve this up. Now, you can either grate your cheese or shave it whatever suits you i happen to like it grated i'll do one of each and you can choose yourself it's just a bit of parmesan cheese there just using a potato peeler just shave off some pieces of the cheese no more economical doing it one way or the other but it tends to blend in a little with the color of the pasta Yum, yum. Just made a little salad of grape and cherry tomatoes, olives, baby boccaccini, preserved lemon and parsley. I'm just going to give it a little toss around. That's also got some spring onions, some red wine vinegar and a little extra virgin olive oil in it. You could have greens in there if you want to, but it's a pretty balanced pretty delicious meal I think and I'd love to stay and chat but lunch is served. Thanks for watching. Why not check out these other recipes to help make this one? Both found on this channel. <laughs>